afternoon. Welcome to the Daily Office. I'm Brother Bill and this is Evening Prayer for Sunday, July the 31st. It's year one proper 13 and week five in the Psalm cycle. And the scripture for this service, Psalm 34, John chapter 1, verse 43 to 51. And the Song of Mary, uh, chap Luke chapter 1, verse 46 to 55. O oh God, come to my assistance, make haste to help me. Glory to you, source of all being, eternal word and Holy Spirit, as in the beginning, so now and forever. Amen. Alleluia. Alleluia. I will bless the Most High at all times. Alleluia. Psalm 34. I will bless the Most High at all times. God's praise always on my lips. In God my soul shall make its boast. The humble shall hear and be glad. Glorify God most high with me. Together let us praise God's name. I sought the most high and was heard, and from all my terrors set free. Look towards God and be radiant. Let your faces not be abashed. When the poor cry out, God hears them and rescues them from their distress. God's angel is encamped around those who fear God to rescue them. O oh, taste and see that God is good. They are happy who seek refuge in God. Revere the Most High, you saints. They lack nothing who revere God. Young lions suffer want and go hungry. But those who seek God lack no blessing. Come, children, hear me, that I may teach you the fear of God, which for you is which of you long for life and many days to enjoy your prosperity? Then keep your tongue from evil and your lips from speaking deceit. Turn aside from evil and do good, and seek and strive after peace. The eyes of God are toward the just, and God hears their appeal. The face of God rebuffs the wicked to destroy their remembrance from the earth. The righteous call for help, and God hears and rescues them in their distress. God is close to the brokenhearted and saves those whose spirits are crushed. Many are the trials of the upright, but you will come to rescue them, keeping guard over all their bones. Not one of their bones shall be broken. Evil brings death to the wicked. Those who hate the good are doomed. The Most High ransoms the souls of the faithful, and none who trust in God shall be condemned. Glory to you, source of all being, eternal word and Holy Spirit, as in the beginning, so now and forever. Amen. Alleluia. Alleluia. I will bless the Most High at all times. Alleluia. The lesson is from the Holy Gospel according to John, chapter 1, beginning at verse 43. The next day Jesus decided to go to Galilee, and he found Philip and said to him, Follow me. Now Philip was from Bethsaida, the city of Andrew and Peter. Philip found Nathanael and said to him, We have found him about whom Moses in the law and also the prophets wrote, Jesus, son of Joseph from Nazareth. And Nathanael said to him, Can anything good come out of Nazareth? And Philip said, Come and see. And when Jesus saw Nathanael coming toward him, he said of him, Here is truly an Israelite in whom there is no deceit. Nathanael asked him, Where did you get to know me? And Jesus answered, I saw you under the fig tree before Philip called you. Nathanael replied, Rabbi, you are the Son of God, you are the King of Israel. And Jesus answered, Do you believe because I told you that I saw you under the fig tree? You will see greater things than these. And he said to him, Very truly I tell you, you will see heaven opened and the angels of God ascending and descending upon the Son of Man. Here ends the lesson. Now let us offer our prayers and petitions. Show us your mercy, O God, and grant us your salvation. Clothe your ministers with righteousness. Let your people sing with joy. Give peace in Jerusalem and in all the world, for only in you can we live in safety. Keep this nation in your care and guide us in the way of justice and truth. 
Let your way be known upon the earth, and your saving help among all nations. Let not the needy be forgotten, nor the hope of the poor taken away. Create in us clean hearts, O God, and sustain us by your Holy Spirit, and for all of your intentions. Our Father, which art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Alleluia, my soul proclaims your greatness. Alleluia, the song of Mary. My soul proclaims your greatness, and my spirit rejoices in God my Savior. For you have looked with favor on your lowly servant. From this day all generations will call me blessed. You have done great things for me. Holy is your name. You have mercy on those who fear you in every generation. You have shown the strength of your arm. You have scattered the proud in their conceit. You've cast down the mighty from their thrones, and you have lifted the lowly. You have filled the hungry with good things, and the rich you have sent away empty. You've come to the help of your servant Israel. For you have remembered your promise of mercy, the promise you made to our ancestors, to Abraham and Sarah and their children forever. Glory to you, source of all being, eternal word and Holy Spirit, as in the beginning, so now and forever. Amen. Alleluia. Alleluia. My soul proclaims your greatness. Alleluia. <laughs> Bless Yahweh, my soul, and may the God of hope fill us with all joy and peace in believing through the power of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Alleluia.